Hi everyone, my name is Sean Tusi. I'm CEO and co-founder of a startup called Glow3Dapp.com. We are focused on 360 product photography for e-commerce using mobile and desktop apps. In this video, I will go over how to go from a typical Squarespace online store product page like this uh, to a product page with 360 image integrated as well as interactive 360 photo where you can move it around and see it from different angles and you will be able to zoom in to capture and see more details obviously you can use just the 360 spin gif which is what we're using here or you could use the interactive or both of them depends on what you like plus you can have your um, custom watermark set out or have no watermark depends on how you choose to uh, set it up so without any further ado let's get started here I'm in my product page I have four products and the plan is to make some modification to this beautiful animal shaped vessel so I'll go to this page currently it's just 2d images and uh, now I'll double click on the product page and um, first I would like to add a the 360 spin image as a gif and then we'll add an interactive 360 as well uh, to do that I will go to th glow3d.net where I have already created a 360 photo of uh, my product uh, if you'd like to learn how to create images like this 360 and do 360 product photography um, there is a link somewhere in this screen where you can click and learn different ways of creating 360 photos using no turntable, using manual turntable, using any motorized turntable, um, and uh, you will see different ways with different size objects from um, small size to large size like cars and, um, and motorcycles and uh, bigger objects. So once I created this, I will go here and I will click on download GIF. So you will see a message here that will um, give you a better quality if you do it from mobile or do from our desktop app, which is available to pro members, but you could still use this and I'll go ahead and say general GIF. Um, I will turn this on the watermark and I will set this to my store and I will say I need the large size and I will download the GIF. So what it does, it goes through the process and downloads it. So once a download complete, uh, it will ask me to save the file. So I will find a place and save the file. And um, I will go back to my product page. And here I will say upload image. And I will select the GIF that I just made. It may take a little bit longer to upload the GIFs as they're sometimes higher sizes than what a typical 2D image is. Once my image is complete, as you see, this is the spin image and I can decide to have it as a secondary images or in this case, I would like to move it and have my uh, default image or my first image that people will see when they will be coming into my online store into the product page. Uh, now I want to add the 360 uh, photo the interactive version of it and I'll go to additional info and I click on this plus and I click on embed and in here I will click on this icons here and here I'll have to paste the embed code of my 360 photo so I, for that I go to glow3d.net my object I right click on the three dots here and I say I would like to share it I want the embed code. So here you can decide what size you would like. So in this case, um, I will go, let's say 700 on one side and it automatically adjusts to the size that um, the other side will make the adjustments and I will say copy embed. So this could be bigger, this could be smaller, depends on how your online store is set up. So your numbers could be very different from what I chose here for the sample store. Now we'll copy paste this. I'll say set. So what it does, it embeds that 360 photo right here. I can say apply. I can say save. 
now we're all done. So the page ref refreshes. And now when I go to this product page, I have my 360 GIF, the spin image. And I also have my 360 photo that is interactive. I can move it around and see it from different angles. As you see here, that easy, that fast. Thank you for watching.